Morning everyone. Um, on a wee short walk this morning um, in a place outside Port of Noam called Clary and today we are in Green Law in a Shrush pathway. Um, been here a few times, it was the first time I've done a video in it so it's been interesting me video. There's a couple of walks here you can do. There's a green route at 4.7 kilometres and there's the red route at 3.5 kilometres. Um, so interesting short day the weather's to be bad here it's turning bad at 12 o'clock so i thought it was just take down the road a wee run just to see how things are the claddy river here is very famous for its trout freshwater trout and I suppose there's an angling club to say where we started at there this morning so um uh, certainly a river full of life and it's flowing clean and so far you know, the wee walk looks well maintained, nice concrete path. So we'll, we'll just keep continuing on to see what we find. We're um, 0.6 mile into the walk, um, concrete path. Um, it seems to be farmland that's been opened up to the Anglican Club um, for this walk so far. Now, there's no signposts as yet, but I'm sure they'll come later on. 
and even at the gates there if you see doggy poo bags so they, they do keep it clean keep it tidy and they encourage you to lift your litter Airbnb, what more do you want? That seems the end of the concrete path. Now we're on to a little bit of a track, but it's still clean and tidy and it's good walking. The place has been sprayed down and left ready for the walkers. Um, so far, it's, it's certainly a nice way to go. Great place to have a bath. What more do you want? The pathway seems to be through the Ban Valley community group here and um, officers families involved in the Whites, McPeaks, McLaughlin's and Diamonds and Laggins so it seems to be that families and groups have created this path and helped. <laughs>
signpost maybe not too good at the minute but at the minute we're outside St Mary's Chapel and um, according to this here that's where we're at so we're still in the green lock in this rush pathway and um, I just have to now find my way back again um, but it shows a circular route so I'll we'll just have to keep going on and we'll see man over there fishing and uh, this seems to be some sort of holding center for vintage materials and things like that there and um, I just can't find a way in or any signs of what it's about but there's certainly there must be a wee bit of history inside that building and um, we've done a bit maybe 0.8 of a mile of walk on the road through an Ennis Rush and now we're back into the path again that will lead us back into our starting point. And the rain certainly is not disappointed that it started again but listen and not dumping our spirits we just keep walking and enjoying the day.
slightly over three miles of a walk perfect walk for a beginner perfect walk just to get outdoors get a bit of fresh air in your lungs um, well passed sign posts aren't good I have to say um, for direction but equally I was able to get round there's a lady direct me you had to go into that village but an interesting walk lovely beside the river lovely beside Necker and um, it's close to you so why wouldn't you do it I'm perfectly placed for it. Listen, thank you for subscribing to my videos. I try to release a video every week. Um, certainly, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, share, and even if there's a comment or two, it does no harm. And also, press bell for reminders when the videos come up. Thank you for watching.